Well, a Banksy painting depicting nurses as superheroes has raised close to $20 million for British health charities. The artwork, called Game Changer, sold at a Christie's auction on Tuesday for $19.85 million, the highest ever price for a Banksy painting. It happened on the same day the UK was marking its one-year anniversary since the first coronavirus lockdown was imposed. Sarah Morris reports. So, ladies and gentlemen, we come to the Banksy, the game changer, lot number six in the sale here. The painting was expected to bring $5 million, but from the start, the bidding was frenzied. Four million I have here. The initial estimate was soon passed, but the bids kept going. Five million pounds. And going. Nine million is the bid. Until finally the hammer came down. The game changer by Banksy at 14 million 400,000 is. Sold. Well done. 14.4 million pounds is roughly 19.85 million dollars. All of that will be donated to charities associated with the British National Health Service, known as the NHS. What an incredibly significant emblem of what we've all been through and the incredible support of the NHS over several months now and probably a few more to come. Banksy sent the artwork to an English hospital during the first wave of the coronavirus outbreak last year as a tribute to all British frontline health workers. It shows a young boy lifting a nurse, her arms stretched and wearing a cape, while traditional superheroes Batman and Spider-Man lie in a bin. A gesture much appreciated by health workers at the time. Just the proudness of it, the, the actual realising that we are thought of and, and respected. Um, for years now we've, we've not, but now with everything that's going on in this current climate, people are seeing us where we should be with superheroes. This is amazing, it's such a nice surprise and it's such a nice reward for all the staff that have been working really hard throughout this. While the original painting is off to a new home, a replica remains on display at the hospital, offering an image of hope and a personal tribute to those who have risked their own lives to fight the pandemic. Sarah Morris, TRT World.